Welcome back to and this guides in today's video we are going to show you how to freeze multiple rows and our columns in Google Sheets. Let's begin. Now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time on Google Sheets, just to follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Freezing multiple rows or columns in Google Sheets is useful when you want certain rows or columns to remain visible as you scroll through large data sets. I always do this a lot because freezing the top rows here allows column headers to remain visible as you scroll down through a large number of data, which is very helpful. It ensures that you always know which data column corresponds to which category, enhancing clarity and usability. Now for us to be able to do that. Now, for example, I want to freeze this entire um row and column this one all they're gonna do is go to the freeze option oh sorry go to the view and you should be able to see the freeze now you have an option here that says no rows one to two rows or up to one uh, one thousand eight all right or up to column a so uh, for now i'm gonna choose the up to one um one thousand eight all right so let's do that it's a little bit hard let's try it again Go to view, freeze, and up to rows. Now you see. Now you see, when you scroll this one, all right, it's not moving, all right? This is one of the best things when you freeze something in the rows and columns. Because when you are working with a large data sets, for example, you're collaborating with multiple freelancers, clients, your company, your team members, now, this facilitates side-by-side -side comparisons and trend analysis without losing sight of the data labels. I find it very useful when presenting or sharing Google Sheets as reports or dashboards because freezing rows and columns helps maintain a professional and organized layout. It ensures that document is easy to navigate and understand for stakeholders or recipient. Now, let me undo that for one second. I'm going to this one is the uh thing that i am going to uh freeze go to view again freeze and up to row one you see that one all right it's very handy because freezing rows and columns enhances the overall user experience by making google sheets more intuitive and user friendly that's it for today's video i hope that was helpful and i believe that's it thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one.